Hello everyone. The paper we will discuss today is Overview of the Spark Physics Basis towards the Exploration of Burning Plasma Resumes in High Field Compact Tokamaks. Abstract The Spark Tokamak project, currently in engineering design, aims to achieve break even and burning plasma conditions in a compact device, thanks to new developments in high temperature superconductor technology with a magnetic field of 12.2 tesla on axis and 8.7 mega ampere of plasma current. Spark is predicted to produce 140 megawatt of fusion power with a plasma gain of Q equal 11, providing ample margin with respect to its mission of Q bigger than 2. All tokamak systems are being designed to produce this landmark plasma discharge thus enabling the study of burning plasma physics and tokamak operations in reactor relevant conditions to pave the way for the design and construction of a compact high field fusion power plant construction of spark is planned to begin by mid 2021. Section 1. Introduction. The development of high temperature superconductors, HTS, in recent years is driving a revolution in fusion science and technology. The use of high magnetic fields to confine plasma in both tokamak and sterilator designs leads to more stability and better performance, reducing mass in size by increasing the mag magnetic field intensity results in burning plasma experiments that are generally easier and faster to build and fusion power plant concept that are economically attractive. Thanks to this, the construction of a U.S. fusion pilot plant at low capital cost in the near term becomes feasible and is in line with the recommendations from the National Academies of Sciences, Engineering and Medicine. The American Phys Physical Society and the DOE Fusion Energy Sciences Advisory Committee culminating from a long-range strategic planning process. The development of economically attractive fusion power plants based on HTS technology is critical for the timely large-scale adoption of fusion energy to mitigate the effects of climate change. The MIT Plasma Science and Fusion Center and the private company Commonwealth Fusion Systems CFS are now finalizing the design of SPARC, a demonstration device aimed at fusing deuterium D and tritium T and exceeding break-even plasma conditions. That is to create and confine plasmas that produce more power by fusion reactions than absorbed from the external heating systems. This milestone 
never achieved in a controlled magnetic confinement fusion device to date will allow the study of net energy plasmas resumes and the demonstration of HTS magnet technology integrated with the rest of tokamak systems at reactor relevant conditions. This demonstration will pave the way towards the construction of a compact pilot plant, largely based on the ARC concept, by the second half of the next decade. This paper presents the status of the SPARC project, Section 2, and a description of the main scenarios that SPARC is designed to achieve, Section 3, the core plasma physics of the main net energy scenario is discussed, Section 4, as well as the heat flux handling, Section 5, and disruption mitigation, Section 6. Strategies that are currently planned, lastly conclusions, Section 7 are presented. Thank you for listening to the end of today's show.